The U.S. Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, CDC, has added St. Kizinevis to its lowest rank category for travel during the pandemic, which is level one, as of Monday, the 11th of April. While some regions around the world, including much of Europe, remain at the CDC's highest travel risk, which is level four, St. Kitts and Nevis has gained the confidence of the CDC and the reputation of a country that has successfully managed the dreaded COVID-19 pandemic, which has wreaked havoc on economies and livelihoods globally. With a high vaccination rate of 83% of the adult population receiving a first dose and 78% fully vaccinated, it is one of the highest in the Caribbean. At the time of this report, there are only five active cases. The country has recorded 43 deaths. Meanwhile, Minister of Health in the Nevis Allen administration, Mayor Brantley, has commended officials on both St. Kitts and Nevis who have worked to help the Federation achieve this status with the CDC. He commended the National COVID-19 Task Force, headed by Abia Samuel, and the Nevis Task Force, headed by Dr. Judy Nisbeth, for their efforts, and said this new development augurs well for those wishing to travel to St. Kitts and Nevis. Non-nationals traveling to St. Kitts and Nevis must be fully vaccinated and follow all COVID-19 regulations for entering the country. Nationals entering the country who are not vaccinated must spend seven days in quarantine. Andre Huey, SKN Newsline.